breaking. Photos emerge as Tenable Visit APC Consensus National Chairman ahead of convention. Welcome to the news and thank you for tuning in to listen. Ahead of the APC's National Convention scheduled for Saturday, March 26th, as Siwaju Bola Met Tenable has taken a strategic step. Tenable, who is a presidential aspirant, paid a solidarity visit to Senator Abdullahi Adamu on Thursday, March 24th. Barring any last-minute change, Senator Adamu is on course to emerge as the next national chairman of the ruling party. Asiwaji Bola Ahmed Tenembo, the national leader of the All Progressive Congress APC and presidential aspirant, has paid the solidarity visit to Senator Abdullahi Adamu on Thursday, March 24th. Senator Abdullahi has reportedly been chosen as the APC's consensus national chairman ahead of a March 26th National Convention. Meanwhile, the leaders of the ruling or Progressive Congress APC in Coast Sophie Federal Constituency Area of Lagos State have declared the support for the presidential ambition of a national leader of the party, Tinubu, in 2023. The APC stalwarts made the unanimous decision on Thursday, March 24th, during the official launching of Tenable Support Group TSG held at the Joto area of the state. Speaking at the event, the leader of the APC in Ekpe Division, Al Haji Akani Sariki Bamu, said Tenable has been instrumental to the success of many people across the country politically. In another previous report by Legidus NG, some Christian clerics under the auspices of Northern Clergy and Christian for Tenembu 23 on Thursday, March 24th, held a prayer session for Tenembu at the Unity Foundation Abuja. The Christian preacher said a decision to pray for the presidential ambition of the former legal state governor was informed by the Holy Spirit. They offered prayers for the will of God for Senator Tenembu's presidential ambition to come to fruition at the rally, which was also well attended by their followers. Well, well, well. Well, 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 it is almost here. We just have to be a little more patient and see how, how this all plays out. All our worries, all our analysis, everything, we go know whether it makes sense or it doesn't make sense in just a few hours to come. After the convention, then we can now start looking at the primaries. The energy and time you people are wasting and attacking to number if people that advise you to promote your choice candidate, it could have been better and be more meaningful. I go with this person's point. I've always been the time and energy you will use to spend and, you know, say things against Tunumbu. Look, the more you say things against him or the more you use words against him, his name will continue to trend and people who don't know him will continue to know him. And of course, they're going to be bought over. Yes, they'll be like this person, everybody's saying everything against. What exactly is the problem? I want to know. What did he do? What kind of a person is he? That is why I said, instead of coming out to, you know, condemn him, why don't you preach competency? Why don't you go out and preach, you know, that your candidate has competency and that your candidate is a nation builder and back it up with the person good work if the person has. And of course, it is going to be far better than coming out to use the same energy. Energy that will not see you, energy will be managed. You are need to promote somebody's work with, as you don't know. You say you don't like this person, but you're talking about him all the time. What does it mean? It means you actually love the person. At the end of it all, we're going to, it's almost here. So no need for too much um, stressing of ourselves or too much analysis. Okay, and this is we have come to the end of the news. We say thank you for tuning in to listen. And until I come here next time, enjoy the rest of the day.